Hey, what's up, everybody? So how to make a vignette in Avid. No Boris effects, no Sapphire effects, just plain Avid. So you want to go to Filters Key, Animate Tool. And I'm just going to drag this over this shot right here. Now, what I like to do when I'm making the Animat is I want to hit Control K to make this smaller so I can see the outsides. And what I'm going to do in Effect Editor is I'm going to hit the circle. And I'm just going to drag a big circle here. And that's, you can always adjust this uh, custom any way you want to at any point later. And what I'm going to do here is add the feathering. And what's going to happen here is, and you see here I have this, this black edges called a vignette talked about this before I really like a vignette effect for bad looking video or especially you're looking something for the past or something like that and it's really that simple I'm really just making that circle and adjusting what I can here this is uh, if you see the size of my circle I, I, I've wound up liking this one so now the question is let's say I like this what would I do with this now I would save this for any new editors here you can drag this clip into a bin and in this case I would call this vignette and now forever and ever I can just drag and drop this beautiful vignette onto any shot I want to or even cooler if I drag lasso from starting from up here and go to all these clips and then I double click vignette and look at that it's on every single clip this nice little vignette look. So that is how to make a vignette. What am I going to drink this weekend? I've been drinking this Five Burrows Brewing Company Tiny Juicy IPA. I can't tell you how much I like it. It's like my newest favorite beer. I'm even at the point when I'm cleaning up the beers in the morning and putting them out in the recycling bin, I get the smell of the, of the you know, the leftover, the spilled in the recycling bin, and it, it I, I love it. I love it makes me want to drink right away, even though it's 7.30 in the morning. So I, I will hold off into the afternoon, and I hope you learn something from this. And if you know someone who wants to learn Avid with short three- to four-minute videos that get right to the point, go to avidbeer.com. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.